Hey ladies, so week two of the vitamin D connection, we're talking about boosting your balance journey by supporting your vitamin D levels. So last week I talked a lot about what vitamin D does for so many different systems in your body. So of course bone health, but immune regulation, hormone production, muscle and nerve um, connection, all those different things. There's so much that goes into it and we talked about optimal levels of vitamin D being between 50 to 80 nanograms per milliliter and that's something that you can have tested um, with your general physician, your PCP, just in your routine blood work. Okay, so today though I want to talk about what you can do if you're experiencing any of these symptoms of low vitamin D and or you possibly have labs to confirm that you do not have enough vitamin D in your body. So what can we do to improve those levels? So there's three main things that I recommend in their uh, most natural way that we can increase those levels. Okay, so first and most inexpensively, you can get 10 to 15 minutes of direct sunlight on a daily basis to naturally increase those vitamin D levels and to get you to an optimal healthy range that you can stay at. Okay, so what you want to do, if you don't want to go out in like the early morning hours or late evening, it needs to be like midday when the sun is at its peak, like its height, it's right above you. You want to sit out in the sun facing directly towards it. Don't look right at it, of course, <laughs> but you want to be facing the sun and you want to get as much skin exposed to the sun as possible. So let your belly out, put the arms out, pull up your pant legs um, and face that sun for 10 to 15 minutes. And if you do this on a consistent level, it can truly help you naturally increase those vitamin D levels and get them up pretty quickly if you're doing it pretty consistently, okay? But I know with the way that life is nowadays, a lot of us work in an office nine to five, it doesn't even have windows, um, or we're inside with the kids because it's just too unbearably hot to be outside with them, it's unsafe. Um, lots of different factors, maybe you live somewhere that is raining all the time and you're, there just is no sunlight, okay? So there's two other things that we can do. The second thing that you can do is to obtain more vitamin D from your food sources, okay? So our standard American diet, this American food system, it is just terrible, it is crap, don't get me started, okay? But we can make changes and we can, can control what goes into our mouth and we can increase our vitamin D levels with just a few small things incorporating into our day to day, okay? so. Some of the highest uh, amounts of vitamin D in foods are going to come from your fatty fish. So things like tuna, things like salmon and trout. So those are gonna be loaded with vitamin D. So if you can incorporate those two to three times per week, a fatty fish, like a four to five, six ounce a piece of salmon, sockeye wild caught, that is gonna be excellent to naturally increase in your levels. You can also consume full fat dairy and milk and like cheeses and things like that. Those are also going to have readily absorbable vitamin D that you can naturally increase those levels. There's also some plant sources. Things like mushrooms have a really good amount of vitamin D in them. So this week in our uh, member email and in the um, Member Balance Facebook group, I will share a chart with some um, high vitamin D source foods that you could try to incorporate um, in your day-to-day -day or possibly a few times per week, and that can all so help you increase those vitamin D levels. Okay. Lastly, if you're struggling, like, oh my God, I hate fish. I cannot eat salmon. It's disgusting. And I live in a rainy area. I can't do either one of those things. Um, what you also can do is take a high quality vitamin D supplement. So when it comes to supplements, supplements are not very regulated at all. So essentially any company out there could put some baby powder in a capsule and hand it to you and tell you it's vitamin D and charge you 50 bucks for it, okay? So 
I am not a huge supplement pusher. I am not a huge supplement person, but there are many supplements that are higher quality that are third party tested for things like heavy metals and for efficiency. So actually proving that what's in the capsule is what you're, what you're taking and what you're getting from that's on the label. Okay. So there are some great companies out there and supplementing with vitamin D can be very beneficial, especially if your levels are severely low as we talked about. Okay, so when it comes to a vitamin D supplement, there's a couple factors you want to keep in mind. So vitamin D is a fat soluble vitamin. So it needs to be taken with a fat source to be readily absorbed, okay? So, AKA fatty fish, right? So we need to take it with a fat source. So either the capsule or the supplement should include a non-inflammatory um, fat source. So a lot of them will come with coconut oil, um, and things like that, which is non-inflammatory, um, or you want to make sure, you can do both actually, you want to make sure you take it with a fat source with your meal, okay? So if you're taking a vitamin D supplement and there's no source of fat anywhere to be found, it ain't going to work for you, okay? So you want to take it with a fat source or make sure that the supplement you are taking contains that fat source already and that will help your body absorb it. So where's a good place to start? Typically 2000 IUs of vitamin D um, just one time per day is recommended for maybe about a six week period to try to get your levels up. If you are super deficient, then you can boost it up to two times per day and maybe take it with your breakfast and your dinner like if you are under 20 um it, I, that would be grounds for taking 2000 um 2000 IUs twice per day and do it for a period of 6 weeks and retest and see if you can get those levels up okay so Check your member email and your Balance Facebook group this week because I now have a Balance Full Script account, which gives myself and you access to medical grade supplements that, like I told you, are third party tested. We know what you're getting is in the in the supplement is what's actually on the label. It's what you're supposed to be getting. Third party tested for like heavy metals and and no fillers, no glutens no soys, no crazy other things um, that we don't need in our supplements, okay? So I'm gonna share a link with you guys this week to my full script account, the Balance Full Script account, where you will see the vitamin D supplement that I take myself and I recommend to my one-on-one -on -one clients that I work with um, at a discounted rate for being a Balance member, okay? So check your member Facebook group this week and as well as your member email. If your vitamin D levels are in the tank, you're ready to start working on the sun and the food, but a supplement really could help boost you and get you over this hump of these symptoms from the low vitamin D, definitely check out the Balance Full Script account. Check out that vitamin D supplement, Pure Encapsulations. I love their brand. I love their quality. You will definitely reap the benefits from that. Okay? And don't forget, if you're really struggling out there, you don't have to do it alone. If the weight is just not coming off, you cannot figure out why you just can't get out of your own way, maybe why you just have absolutely no energy to do the workouts whatsoever. There could be something deeper going on. There could be something hormonally going on, gut health, vitamin D, micronutrients, whatever it might be, I'm here to help. All you have to do is go to the support tab on the Balance app and press the chat with with Christy Button, book your one-on-one -on -one appointment. Me and you together as a team will get to the bottom of what's going on and we will get you feeling your best sooner than later. All right. All right. If you guys have any questions about your vitamin D, the levels, um, how to get it tested or um, where, how to get them higher or anything like that, shoot me a quick message. But if there's something else going on that we need to dive deeper in together, please book one of those one-on-one -on -one appointments. Just click the chat with Christy button and you guys have a great week. Bye.